Welcome back to the playlist of how to make an e-commerce website using WordPress and this site can be used to sell beats or to sell music or anything digital. So on this video, we're going to be focusing on setting up our hosting and our domain because we need those two to get our website running. So for this tutorial, we're going to use hostinger.com. There's also other hosting services like Cloudways, which have good reputations as well. So it's up to you on which one you use. But if you want to follow step by step, then you can use Hostinger. So there's two ways to set up your WordPress hosting and you're going to cover both of them. The first way is if you already have Hostinger and you want to add your new website as an additional website or you want to add it as a subdomain. So to do that, just log into your Hostinger panel and you're going to go to websites. So here you're going to see all the websites you have. Just select the one where you want to install the new bit store or the new WordPress website. I'm going to use this one where it says my bit.store. So I'm going to click on manage. Then I'm going to create a subdomain. So I'm going to click on search, type sub. Here's subdomains. Okay, cool. So I'm going to call this subdomain test.com my bit.store so this is the subdomain that i'm gonna use so you can use any subdomain you want it could be beats.yourdomain.com you know so i'm gonna click on uh create custom folder for it so it can be in a different custom folder so i can delete it easily and click on create so once that is created i'm gonna go back and search for wordpress overview you know scroll down and go to install another wordpress you're gonna type the name so the name of this website will give it uh let's say uh m roger beats so type in the website title and then here you're gonna type in your email your username and your password so this is new it's gonna be created now as you create this subdomain uh, wordpress install then once you've entered your information here just click on advanced and then here by advanced you have to click here and select test.mybitstore because this is the one that we want to install this wordpress website on then click next oh i didn't put in the password let me type in my password there it is then click next then click on install just give it a couple of seconds and it's gonna be done installing okay great now my wordpress website has installed you can see the website name is mybit.store but the name of the subdomain is test.mybit.store so i'm gonna make sure i select that and click on edit website and this will take me to my fresh and brand new wordpress hosting this is how you set up your hosting and domain if you already have hosting but if you didn't have hosting and this is your first installation then you can follow the following instructions okay then click on the link in the description below and it will bring you to this page and just select wordpress so you can select any other one that you want i must select this one and add to cart then i'm gonna scroll down make sure you select one month if you want to pay it monthly but then if you want to pay it every two years you can select this one I select monthly then i'm gonna enter my information here and my payment details then i'm gonna wait for an email from hostinger okay so i got my email from hostinger so i'm gonna click on sign in click on start now then select wordpress type in a new email and password then choose continue then click skip then choose a domain name you can buy one or use an existing one type in your domain name and search and see if it's available then click continue then click on finish setup click on finish registration then you're done okay that's it for this video thank you for watching don't forget to hit the subscribe button then i'll see you on the next video